Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. It's spring. Let's dig into our spring fabric scraps and make my favorite bunny gill together. First, let's print the pattern. Here comes the iron adhesive paper. The adhesive paper has two sides. One is non-stick and the other has iron glue. Double check to ensure the non-stick paper side is facing up. We trace our bound web templates on the non-stick paper side. We cut it according to the chosen fabric. Iron this bond web tracing onto the reverse side of the fabrics you have chosen. Carefully cut the tracings out. Place a sheet of baking paper over the tracing template and secure it with masking tape. Peel off the non-stick paper from your applique pieces. In this order, adhere the applique pieces. Start with her face. Followed by her ear number two. Then the legs. Put her beautiful dress on. Ensure that all the appliques adhere to the outline. Don't worry about overlaps. It's designed that way for a secure attachment. I add ear number one on. Then the cotton tail. her hand and lastly her flowers you can peel it off as a whole once it has cooled down Iron her onto the base felt. 
Now let's cut out two tracing templates for her arm and eye position. For the eye position piece, align it with the chain and mark the location of the eye. It's time to start our free motion embroidery with black thread. of the excess thread. Add a little brush to her face. Place another piece of felt beneath our girl. Insert a string in between for hanging if you want her as a decoration or a bookmark. Change the thread to white around the outline. Cut off the excess felt. Our cute bunny is here. Thank you for watching.